Well, downtown parking woes in the spotlight tonight after several Billings motorists were ticketed for parking in a paid lot after hours during last week's Christmas stroll. Now, the lot in question is owned by Diamond Parking Service out of Seattle. One Billings man believes the company used the Christmas stroll as a way to cash in on parking violations. Officials with Diamond Parking Service tell us, however, that parking without paying is just like stealing from a local business. And they believe this incident might be a way to draw some awareness about their parking service. Diamond operates 19 parking lots that are scattered throughout downtown Billings. They include as many as 2,200 parking spaces. Manager Peter Sanderson says those Diamond lots have been around for 35 years. And when people complain about not enough parking, Diamond offers a service to those wanting to shop and dine downtown. Still, Billings resident Jeff Blotnick feels duped by the situation. He says he saw nearly 30 tickets placed on cars the evening of the Christmas stroll, and he says, like many residents, he thought parking after five was free. He believes if there's too many hurdles to shop downtown, it could hurt the city. Everybody is working hard to keep downtown alive. Um, the Downtown Business Association works hard to pull people in, it has community events like this. Um, you know, several people mentioned that because of the paid parking, they, they can go to the West End and they don't have to pay for any of the parking. There's no meters. Um, a, a couple of people and the folks in the community said that, you know, they work downtown and they have to pay for parking. So, I mean, you have to pay to work down there and you also have to pay to shop. In light of Blotnick's complaint, Diamond Parking Service points out that all of its lots are paid parking 24-7 and are well marked to alert visitors. Uh, during the Christmas stroll, Diamond offered a $3 rate which covered 15 hours of parking to help combat the issues of drinking and driving.